constitution of the next government which is not only egalitarian in nature but which is founded upon the tenets of equality equanimity and social justice our goal is common that the middle class in this country is not plagued if you see this cylinder behind me that they have to pay 1100 rupees for that cylinder i was asked i was talking to our my senior colleague an mnc shri kanda ji mohan with mr salim ahmed with mr gorav vallab there is a common struggle that both cpi and the congress have when we seek to form the next congress government in the state we believe a commonality of ideas and ideology despite some differences of opinion is paramount and imperative all forces which believe in equality equanimity social justice welfare of the poor and the middle class and ensuring that the government is run for people and not for brazen loot of those in power they have to such forces must come together and that's why and that's why we reached out to the communist party of india they have fielded seven candidates they were going to field more candidates i personally as also the party both sidaramaiya ji dk shivkumar ji we requested the state secretary we requested their central uh, leadership they agreed that there will be a friendly contest on the seven seats but on all the remaining seats that is all all the remaining 197 seats the entire cpi cadre will hold heartily without any precondition or expectation support the congress candidates in this fight against the bjp that's a historical decision that my esteemed senior seasoned experienced colleagues of the cpi have taken and i am deeply grateful for it and i thank them from this platform of the congress party to each one of them and to their cadre they have extended support they have extended support sorry i my mathematics is because i am from haryana out when you take out from 7 from 224 you are contesting 7 they are yeah 215 seats not 197 seats 215 seats professor gorav vallabh was quick to correct me and i stand corrected 215 seats they were